Hi everyone, in this video I will mention 10 common problems that third generation Jeep Wrangler two-door vehicles are prone to experience. Number 1. Jeep Wranglers are prone to experience what is commonly known as the death wobble. What this death wobble is, when driving over a bump, the Jeep tends to start shaking violently and at that point it becomes very hard to maintain control of the vehicle. Majority of times it is necessary to pull over in order to stop the vehicle from shaking. This problem tends to develop as the suspension and steering components like ball joints, tie rod ends, bushings and so forth start to wear out developing play and altering the alignment of the vehicle. Installing a heavy duty aftermarket steering damper helps to minimize this problem. However, it's very important to replace the worn parts and have the vehicle professionally aligned to stop the problem completely. Number 2. The Totally Integrated Power Module, also known as TIPM, tends to malfunction and cause some of the following issues. Engine stalls while driving. Horn goes off randomly. Fuel pump stays on after the engine has been turned off. Power windows stop working. Door locks start locking and unlocking the doors on their own, among other issues. Number 3. The exhaust manifolds tend to crack and develop exhaust leaks. One way to keep this issue from being an ongoing problem is to replace the crack manifolds with high quality aftermarket headers. Plus the exhaust sound will be much better with the headers anyways. Number 4. Another problem that these jeeps tend to develop over time is a no-star condition. Sometimes when the driver tries to turn the engine over, all that is heard is a clicking sound from the starter solenoid. Other times there are no sounds at all. This problem in most cases is caused by a malfunctioning ignition switch. In other cases, the problem is another symptom of a failing TIPM. Number 5. Many 07 to 18 Jeep Wranglers have caught on fire over the years. Because each vehicle has caught on fire under different driving conditions and circumstances, it is still undetermined the exact cause of the problem. Number 6. Another problem that Jeep Wrangler vehicles develop is gasoline spilling out when filling the gas tank at the gas pump. This problem is caused by a malfunctioning check valve inside the filler tube. Replacing the filler hose that is shown in the image solves this hazardous problem. Number 7. The clock spring in the steering column tends to malfunction as these vehicles age. When this part starts to malfunction, the airbag light on the dash turns on and off randomly. Sometimes the horn doesn't work. And in rare cases, the windshield wipers stop working due to a faulty clock spring. Number 8. 3.6 liter 6 cylinder engines tend to develop cylinder head problems. The most common symptom is the engine having cylinder misfires. This problem is caused by poor seal in between the valve and the valve seat of the affected cylinder. When the valves don't seal properly, that cylinder has either low compression or no compression at all. Number 9. The needle bearings in the rocker arms of the 3.6 liter engine tend to experience premature failure. When these bearings fail, the rocker arm develops excessive play. This play causes loud ticking noises coming from inside the engine. If the damaged rocker arm is not replaced on time, it runs the risk of having the roller locking up completely and destroying the camshaft lobe in the process. Number 10. Another issue found in the 3.6 liter 6 cylinder engines is hydraulic lifters having the tendency to collapse. This problem also causes ticking noises coming from inside the engine due to excessive clearance between the lifter and the rocker arm. There you have it my friends. Those are 10 common problems that third generation Jeep Wrangler two-door vehicles are prone to experience. Take care.